People in Southeast Texas are known for supporting one another, and now a local man who found himself in a devastating situation last year needs his community. Daybreak reporter Cameron Burchett is in studio with details. Hey, Cam. Hey, Tia. Billy Van Pelt is a beloved youth football coach who has been coaching everywhere in the Golden Triangle since 2009. After Billy suffered an accident last year, the community is coming together to help support his family. They were trying to keep me alive, so it was either my leg or my life. For the Van Pelt family, their world turned upside down last August when no one heard from Billy Van Pelt after leaving a LCM scrimmage game on his motorcycle. There was just no avoiding it. My instant thought was, how bad is this going to be? And I was calling him and texting him and checking his location and that, doing that over and over again. All of a sudden, his location stops at St. Elizabeth. And so I knew right then something was wrong. A feeling that lingered until Brittany received a call saying her husband, Billy, was about to be intubated after a serious accident. And I was like, what? What do you mean, intubate him? And she's like, well, we're about to have to amputate his leg. Once family arrived to the hospital, they realized just how critical his situation was. And I kept passing in the hospital, so it wasn't like it was just, oh, I lost my leg. There was a, a phase there where I was, they were trying to keep me alive. Yeah, they said it's his life or his leg. The decision was made to amputate Billy's leg, but his family kept his spirits up in non-traditional ways. My family has a lot of dark humor, definitely a lot of one-legged jokes thrown my way. And a year later, the family is needing support for new prosthetics and for Billy's upcoming surgeries. So the community came together and formed a benefit. We're going to have a live DJ from three to nine, washer tournament, face paintings for the kids, balloon animals. It will be this Saturday in Nederland at the American Legion Post 493 on Nederland Avenue. As for Billy's youth football players. I told him I was getting a tattoo and uh, <laughs> they, uh, when I went back to practice, they were like, that's not a tattoo. The benefit will also have t-shirts for sale and plate lunches for just $10. So be sure to come out and get a plate to go. In studio, Cameron Burchett, 12 News.